So now this is uh, one of my uh, favorite effects that you can make with a simple circuit there. We have a 555 timer wired in a stable mode and an LM358 op amp right there as a voltage follower. So the voltage that uh, is in play there is the capacitor voltage there. 100K, 100K resistors, uh, equalizing diode and a 10 microfarad capacitor. So the voltage that's being transferred is actually the capacitor voltage, not the output. That's coming up to the plus input of the op amp. And then the minus input, we got a direct connection to the output. What that does is give an output voltage the same as the capacitor, but the op amp provides power. And uh, as the voltage goes down, the LED on the left gets brighter. And then as the voltage uh, goes up, the LED on the right gets brighter. So now we're zoomed back a bit for those uh, watching the short. As uh, the voltage rises from the op amp output here, that LED gets brighter, this one gets dimmer, and then as the voltage goes uh, down, this LED gets brighter, well that one gets dimmer. We'll uh, zoom in and uh, take a better look at it right there. So there, you can see that. Hopefully you can follow that. This is wired as a voltage follower. It takes a voltage input to the uh, plus input, and then it transfers that voltage out. Basic uh, voltage follower stuff. Um, the changing voltage is actually this capacitor, which cannot power the LEDs directly. That's why we have a voltage follower. So as the uh, capacitor charges uh, right there, the voltage goes up, of course. And then as it uh, discharges, the voltage goes down. We're not using the output of the 555 timer there. I didn't even uh, put it anywhere, uh, number three right there. We're just looking at the capacitor voltage.